religions if they have a role. That's the role for spiritual, uh, spiritual strategies is to feel connected to the divine force. We're all one here. It's called the unified field. We're all connected. But we're encouraged to feel disconnected and through the illusion of our neurology it looks like things are disconnected. So we have to restore ourselves back to our connection with the divine force, God, whatever you want to call it. Then we have to be mentally correct. We've got to be thinking correct thoughts and feeling correct feelings and our thoughts and feelings are two sides of the same coin. Every time you have a thought, you have a feeling. Every time you have a feeling, you have a thought. They're linked. And every time you have a thought slash feeling, biochemistry changes. There's a whole field of science called psychoneuroimmunology. There's, you can go uh, get peer-reviewed journals with scientific studies and controlled experiments all on the connection between the mind and the immune system, between the mind or the psychology and our neurology, psychoneuroimmunology. So working with our thoughts and our working with our feelings is important. This is why meditation is so important. Sitting still, quieting your mind or at least watching your mind. And then there's the physical strategies and there's not a lot of them. Food is the most important. That's the most important burden on the body. And we are encouraged to eat crap by people who make money off us eating crap. And as Kelly wisely pointed out, there's, it's not a coincidence that the drug companies and the food companies are owned by the same multinational corporations. They profit on us by feeding us poison, and they profit on us by the pharmacological remedies, poison remedies for more poison. They're not our friends. And every time we eat a Snickers bar, or every time we eat Doritos, or every time we drive through Taco Bell, we're feeding our enemies. We're supporting our enemies. They are the enemy. Yes, the New World Order is a problem, but we're participating every time we drive through Taco Bell. And I'm not a food Nazi here, you guys. I eat pizza. If I'm hungry, I'll go grab a slice of pizza or whatever. That's not the point. The point isn't that we're bad people or good people if we eat these kinds of foods. The point is that if you're dealing with a chronic degenerative disease, if you're miserable, and I know it's miserable, as a healthcare professional, I'm witness to the misery. The worst is when it happens to a baby or when it happens to a child. I got a letter here from uh, uh, a, a letter from a, somebody who sent me another letter. It says, uh, 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 Here's the deal. Thank you for telling me about all the longevity supplements. Uh, I have to find the right, right combination. I think it's helping, but I just don't notice it. Well, if it's helping, you're going to notice it. Anyway, uh, this, is what, uh, this is what this gal says. Uh, she's got a baby. He will be three years old on April 5th. He has Epstein's anomaly. It's a heart condition of the tricuspid valve that lets non-oxygenated blood flow, bla flow backwards. He also had surgery at three weeks for a co-architation narrowing of the aorta in his heart. Listen, you guys, this is just medical mumbo jumbo. The fact is, it's that this kid's body is falling apart. It says here he's got asthma. This is a three-year-old baby, okay? He's got asthma, which is triggered into severe mode when he gets sick. Of course it is, because his body is burdened. We notice it gets worse when he has an ear infection. So now he gets ear infections too. We have to use more meds to keep him breathing. We have him on an inhaled steroid for his breathing. What does a steroid do? It shuts down the immune system. This is a poor three-year-old kid with a congenital heart issue that is now being bombarded with surgeries and medical strategies and drugs. Here's what you need to do. You need to focus on the kid's digestive system. Now, you're not going to deal, you're not going to fix a congen congenital structural issue necessarily, but you sure are going to reduce the burden on this poor kid's body. Look for digestive problems. If this was, if somebody, uh, this was my patient, I would be saying, what's going on in this kid's digestive system? Does this sound ridiculous that I'm, I'm talking about the digestive system for a kid who's got all of these problems? I hope it doesn't because it's so important. This is a kid that should be focused, or his parents should be focusing on digestive health, looking for food intolerances, focusing on the bowel movements and on gas and on bloating, eliminating any foods that induce any of these kinds of problems. Folks, this is how simple health is. If I, uh, to the day I die, I'm going to be standing on top of every rooftop I could find and screaming, we don't have to be sick. We don't have to have chronic degenerative diseases and this medical model that we have deified and we think is some spectacular uh, pro-humanity life-saving system is killing us. I'm not talking about trauma. I'm not talking about emergencies. I'm talking about long-term chronic breakdown diseases. But it doesn't matter because we can do it all ourselves. 
Get yourself on a good nutritional supplement program. Get yourself on the longevity products. Use the Healthy Start Pack. Get on the ketogenic diet. Reduce the amount of calories and reduce the amount of work that your digestive system has to do. Reduce the amount of work that your liver has to do processing toxins and poisons. And I guarantee you, with 100% certainty, I guarantee you not because necessarily it's scientific or it's it's in the literature, or it's, in, it's, uh, uh, it's been shown to in research to work, Although that's true, I'm guaranteeing you because I've seen it not hundreds of times but thousands of times over the last 18 years. What Kelly spoke about on the phone call, reversing uh, autoimmune disease, eliminating autoimmune diseases, curing. She cured herself of an autoimmune disease by eating butter, by following the ketogenic diet, by changing her digestive strategies. And that's how simple it can be. It's the triangle, folks. You got your food, you got your blood sugar, and you got your adrenal thyroid complex. Control the way you eat. Eating less food. Using liquids. Using soups. Going ketogenic. Going ketogenic. Control your blood sugar. Stabilize your blood sugar with the chromium, the vanadium, and the sweeties, and B vitamins, and magnesium, and taurine, and arginine, and all the other blood, blood sugar stabilizing nutrients. Restrict your intake of processed carbohydrates and sugars and calm the body down with deep breathing and meditation and yoga and relaxation and hot tubs and massages and all the things you could do to calm the body down. That's how simple and that's how easy health can be. Thanks for listening, friends. I'm Pharmacist Ben. Check out my website, brightsideben.com and on my blog, pharmacistben.com as well. well. We'll be back at you tomorrow with more good health information on the Bright Side. Have a wonderful, awesome, spectacular day. I'm Pharmacist Ben. Bye for now. We the people grow cotton, we fabric, engrave ink, embed strips and fibers to protect from counterfeit and carting to a private bank, having it lent back at interest, forcing taxes to service debt. This capitalism, or was Jefferson correct when stating a central bank issuing the public currency is a greater menace to the liberties of the people than a standing army? Ted Anderson, I'm placing a free silver dollar in a book that explains our monetary system. Call for your copy, 800-686-2237. It's time to understand the system. Call 800-686-2237. That's 800-686-2237. Attention listeners, SurvivalLife.com is giving away free Everstrike permanent matches for a limited time only. These matches are waterproof and will light in any weather condition, rain, snow, or sleet. It will still throw a spark. Its built-in ferro rod strikes at 3,000 degrees, and it is good for 15,000 strikes. Normally, $15. Today, it's free. Get yours at FreeSurvivalMatch.com. That's FreeSurvivalMatch.com. Hurry, supplies are limited. Visit FreeSurvivalMatch.com today. If the IRS has garnished your paycheck or seized money from your bank account, you need to get professional tax help now. Fast action is required to put a halt to these aggressive IRS collection tactics. You can count on the knowledgeable team of tax professionals at Wall & Associates. With over 30 years of experience, Wall & Associates has settled the tax problems of thousands of taxpayers for a small fraction of what they owed. For a free face-to-face -face consultation, call 1-800-425-4610 to put a wall between you and the IRS. 1-800-425-4610 or look for us on the web at wallandassociates.net. We solve tax problems. If you hire Walland Associates today, you'll never have to talk to the IRS again. To stop the levies and seizures today, take action now. Call Walland Associates at 1-800-425-4610. Wall and Associates. 1-800-425-4610.